Tobagonians have already started to build the model of Tobago to plan for the impacts of climate change and extreme climatic events. Yesterday, a number of persons assembled at the Blenheim Sheep Multiplication Research Project in Mount St. George to participate in the first ever project of its kind in Tobago. Here are the details on how the project will actually benefit the island. The Caribbean Natural Resource Institute, Canary, has partnered with the Center of Agricultural and Rural Cooperation and the University of the West Indies, among other groups, to build a three-dimensional model of Tobago with the aim of advising persons of being proactive regarding climate change. Neela Bob Prescott, Senior Technical Officer at Canary, told Tobago Channel 5 that the project began with six formers from the Signal Hill Secondary School, Scarborough Secondary School, and the University of the West Indies Open Campus Tobago. What they did was they came in over the first four days and assembled what we call the blank model. So they came in, we had some base maps of Tobago, they painstakingly traced those out on some cardboard sheets and they glued them together and created what we call a three-dimensional model of Tobago. And then they painted it all white. At Blenheim yesterday, different groups participated in the continuation of the project. Among them were members of the Bell Garden, Speyside and Delaford Fishermen Association. Prescott explained what exactly the model of Tobago is being built to achieve. We are using the model to have a more structured and logical approach. From the model we see where the landslides are, where people have put their houses, and maybe we as Tobago people would need to sit down and decide that the messages that we need to communicate now would be those about advising people how to channel rainwater off the hills if they live on hills, how to build um, to, to, to terrace their yards if they live on hills to help them deal with the impacts of climate change rather than dealing with the after effects. Prescott also told us what will happen to the three-dimensional model after it is completed. On next week, Friday, we'll be handing over the model to the THA for storage. And we hope, and as a matter of fact, we have attractive funding from the Federal Republic of Germany to use the model to assist people in Tobago to plan for the impacts of climate change. The Caribbean Natural Resources Institute, Canary, is a regional technical non-profit organization which has been working in the islands of the Caribbean for more than 20 years. Its mission is to promote and facilitate equitable participation and effective collaboration in the management of natural resources critical to development in the Caribbean islands so that people will have a better quality of life and natural resources will be conserved through action learning and research, capacity building, communication and fostering partnerships.